Hi everyone, it's Rachel from Sweet and Simple Home and yes, you did not read that title incorrectly. We are selling our house. I know you probably already saw it on the title, but it's not clickbait, it's true. We sold our house and it went super fast. So as shocking as it is to all of you guys, I'm sure it's still seeking in for us as well. And I waited until I absolutely couldn't not tell you anymore because we need to start packing to share it with you just in case something fell through but it looks like we're rolling right along and the housing market here is actually kind of booming i think a lot of people are leaving the busy cities and coming to the more quiet peaceful areas and i totally understand that so we decided to take advantage of that and put our house on the market well, we just thought we would probably have to rent for a little while just because it is a seller's market. We weren't sure we could afford to buy again. And just with how much we sold our house for, it was kind of shocking to us how much we sold it for. We were able to buy a pre-sale house. So a pre-sale is a house that's not built yet. So we're going to be homeless for a little while. And it's going to be kind of crazy, you guys, because we're going to have to bounce around to family members and with school possibly not starting in person that's definitely one of the question marks for us like whether or not we're gonna go stay with my sister or stay with my parents I mean it's all kind of up in the air so it's a little bit whoo it was a bit of a risk but we're excited about it it's one of the things that's been hard about this house and a lot of houses in our town is that it has a basement and there are very few homes in this area that don't have a basement and that's because a lot of these homes were built from the 30s through the 60s and bedrooms in the basement were a total norm and you guys know we had a house flood last year if you haven't seen any of that i have a whole playlist of what happened with our basement renovation and flood that we had ever since that happened anytime i hear water at night like even if someone just flushes the toilet i wake up like startled because i just i don't know it was just kind of a scary experience so with this pre-sale we don't have a house to move into i don't have a house to show you yet when it is finished being built i will show it to you it's not much bigger it won't be much bigger, I should say, than what we have right now as far as square footage. It's only like 50 square feet more. But without having the basement, it's all laid out on one level. And that's really nice. <sighs> but I got to tell you guys, it has been super crazy to film because I was literally filming between house showings. We had so many. We were on the market for a week and it was just boom, 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 one after the other. And some days I couldn't even get the camera out because I would get a text from my realtor that somebody was coming. And that was crazy. And with COVID, it's not like we can go play at the park or go, you know, play at the swimming pool. All that stuff is closed. <laughs> so <laughs> we had to figure out where to go and what to do during those times with all three of our kids. It was crazy but we got through it and we actually ended up with three offers on the house everything's going really well and i can't believe it it just went so fast so we're gonna miss some things about this house but we're really excited about some of the things in the new house and the timing is a little crazy with things being so up in the air with school and quarantine and all this stuff but we just trust the Lord. We're so grateful that he's given us this opportunity to, to move and to have a house that hopefully will work better for our growing family. And I'm very proud to be handing off to this next family a very sweet and beautiful home. Well, I'm sure you guys have loads of questions. You can leave them down in the comments and I will be sure to address some of them in a future video. Maybe I'll do like an answering your question style video for our move. I do plan on showing you guys some of my moving, my packing, my decluttering, because you know I'm already doing that. <laughs> And uh, I also plan to show you guys some of my staging that I did for this house. My realtor was like, Rachel, you're staging? Awesome. That's the update. That's why my content has been kind of sporadic. Honestly, it's been hard for me to not put out the best quality content for you guys lately. I've just been giving you the best that I can with the time that I had. And that's just been the way it is. So now you know. And now moving forward, when you see a ton of boxes behind me or things that are gone or different or changed, you'll know why and I won't have to be like secretive about it anymore. 
But thanks you guys so much for watching. Be sure you subscribe so you can go with us on this journey and see the new house and all those kinds of things. I can't wait to make another home beautiful little by little. You guys take care and I'll be back with more soon. Bye!